a warm welcome to the Peace Palace, the one and only Peace Palace of the world, where we work with many institutions to promote peace for the people in the world. We are privileged to house here the Permanent Court of Arbitration for which the Peace Palace was established, and the International Court of Justice of the United Nations that settles conflicts between states, as well as the Hague Academy of International Law that yearly educates a thousand students over a hundred countries in the world, all supported by the famous Peace Palace Library with its hundred thousands of publications in the field of international law and international relations. The Peace Palace was built by the generous donation of Andrew Carnegie. It opened its doors in 1913. Different countries from all over the world donated gifts to the Peace Palace, like this vase given by the Tsar Nicholas II. The interior and artworks symbolize the mission of the building. Today there are over 40 gifts to be found in the Peace Palace, just like this huge vase. We're now in a Japanese room. This room is named after the beautiful wall tapestries that adorn the walls. I will show you something special. This wooden box was specially sent from Kyoto, Japan to the Peace Palace to show what the exact designs were, what they were going to be on textile. The design was chosen by Kikuchi Hobun, master painter in Kyoto. The board of the Carnegie Foundation was delighted with the designs and sent the exact measurements of the conference room where the wall tapestries would be placed to Kyoto. These wall tapestries made of silk are donated by the government of Japan. In this room you can spot other gifts of countries. For example, these Chinese vases. They are really large, man's size. They're made of cloisonné and they have wooden pedestals. They are donated by the last emperor of China, Puri. On the floor you can find a very large carpet donated by Turkey, the former Ottoman Empire. This carpet is so large, it's about 160 square meters, and it covers the whole floor of a Japanese room. This carpet was made in the town of Hereke, famous for its tapestries. The carpet probably is one of the largest carpets in the world outside of Turkey. Apart from all the donations, the room is also decorated in an oriental manner. The wainscoting made from tropical woods from Brazil, perfectly matched the wall tapestries and the other elements in the room. Two brass chandeliers with crystal chains and ornaments of doves and suns, symbols of peace and justice, were made in Amsterdam. The original furniture was made of tropical woods and beautifully manufactured to match the wainscoting. All this resulted in a well-thought interior ensemble. Today, the Japanese hall is used for different kinds of meetings and hearings. Twice a year, the member states of the Permanent Court of Arbitration gather here to speak about administrative matters. On this occasion, representatives of member states sit on a chair embroidered with the coat of arms of their country. To preserve the Peace Palace and the magnificent works of art here, we need support. To continue our peace and education activities, we also require support. There are many ways to support the Peace Palace, so please take a good look at our website and join us on our mission to promote world peace. Thank you very much. <laughs>